So let me just have a quick conversation with you, absent, narcissistic, toxic, entitled ass dads, sperm donors. I seriously don't even like using the word dad. I have a feeling she didn't have a good relationship with her father. Remember, lady, father knows best. You hmm, do not get to disrespect the mother of your child who cares for your child financially, emotionally, physically, 24-7. Yeah, you do not get to disrespect the single mom who is screwing up your kid. And then expect when one day of the year comes around, Father's Day, that you get to see your child, be with your child for one day, for a few hours on that day, because you want to look like you're a good dad. You want it to seem like you're a good daddy? You think that you are worthy and deserve that? Fuck you. I'm daddy today, bitch. Do not get to expect to see your kid on Father's Day, even for a few hours, because, you know, they said so. I just can't stand, like, what? Oh, is it the immaturity of our generation or what? But, like, you guys need to tighten up. Oh, my God. I'm mad. I don't know if you can tell. I actually just had a panic attack and I was crying, but now I'm just mad. That's a stage five clinger, guys. Notice how she shakes her hands and her head around while she badmouths basically all fathers while preaching not to disrespect women. This is what many men can expect from modern women. Bad mouthing, bad attitude, a lack of feminine, a lack of feminine traits at all. Um, th think of having a child with this woman. Uh, she will give you and that child hell for over 18 years. So, you know, don't fall in love with the first woman that touches your pee pee, guys, you younger guys. Um, a lot of these women haven't had quality men in their life. And with the effinist movement, propagandizing, they don't know how to be good wives or mothers. And thanks for watching, guys. Please comment, like, subscribe, share, all that good stuff. See you next time.